Hey guys, I'm Vegan Chung. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm reacting to one of my favorite famous cat and mouse duo, Tom and Jerry. Episode Professor Tom, and this was released on October 30th of 1948. Directed by William Hanna and Joseph Barbera, produced by Fred Quimby, and music scored by the talented Scott Bradley. Music and show tunes are what draws people to enjoy cartoons. For anyone who does not know who Scott Bradley is, well, he is the most important composer, if not the best cartoon and music composer in Hollywood golden age of cartoons. Self-taught in composition and orchestration, and also a staff musician for Disney in 1929 with UV Works in the 1930s, music director for Herman Ising and from 1937 with MGM. That is pretty impressive. There were more than 300 cartoons highlighting the antics of Tom and Jerry, Droopy, Barney and Bear, Screwy Squirrel, and George and Jr., and the one-shot gag films that were Avery's specialty. During the early 1930s, he also composed home, poems and oratorials performed in concert in Los Angeles and San Francisco. This was a crossover for some animations to go into the talkie area. Some, but not all. What made this cartoon duo so famous was combining catchy music score with a little talkie as Charlie Chaplin once says, if the tramp speaks, he is dead. If Tom and Jerry were to speak, it would ruin the show. Oh, and I'm glad the screams and yelps are still there. This episode is about Tom, complete with a motherboard is teaching kitten the basics. Cat chases mice. Jerry keeps subverting this lesson every opportunity, adding his own phrases like cats and mice are chums. Eventually, Jerry gets Tom locked out of the house. He runs back in and gets slingshot right into the mailbox. This seems like a very fun episode to watch. So y'all, let's jump right into Professor Tom's classroom. <laughs> Roll the clip. I like this title of this show, Professor Tom. I wonder though, what is he gonna teach us today? <laughs> in holes. Tom looks like he's not interested. He's like, nah. <laughs> Cats chase mice. <laughs> so grumpy, Tom. Mice are very nice. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> now that's some excitement in the classroom. <laughs> he doesn't want to do it, Tom. I love that scream. <laughs> Aunt Jerry is so helpful. <laughs> oh, Tom, leave him out of it. <laughs> He's right behind him. <laughs> oh, Tom, give it up already, won't you? <laughs> Buddies. 
cats and mice are. What did that say? Did it say like chumps? <laughs> That's so wrong. You go burn the house. <laughs> you go get yourself sick too. Super strength too. I've seen this episode, but I find it hilarious and entertaining. Tom is trying to get the kitten into the dark side, but it doesn't seem to work in his favor, and the kitten doesn't seem to be interested at all. He wants to be friends with Jerry, and the best part was they were working together as a team to teach Tom a lesson. And I like those in Vaz theme at the end. They were jumping together for their flawless victory. <laughs> what did you guys think about the episode? And what other Hanna-Barbera characters should I watch next? 
let me know in the comments below. I'm your host, Anika Chung, and I'll see you next time on my next motion picture or trailer review. Love yourself always, and remember, be excellent to each other. All right, guys, see you in the next picture. Cheers, and that is a wrap. Cheers. Maximus Decimus Meridius.